Geobyte. Hello students, welcome to Geobyte. In the previous video, we discussed the exercise 2.5, question number 3 and 4. Today, let us solve question number 5 and 6 from exercise 2.5. Fifth question is, write the following decimal numbers in the expanded form. First one, twenty point zero three. So we need to represent the following decimal number in expanded form. We have twenty point zero three is equals to now here we are having zero. This zero at one's place and 2 is at tens place and this 0 is at uh, tenths place and 3 is at hundred place. Now what we can write is so 2 is at which position? So tens place. So tens place means 2 into 10 plus. Now 0 is at which position? 1's place. So 0 into 1 plus now this 0 is at tenths place so 0 into 1 by 10 and after that we are having plus 3 3 is at hundredth place so 3 into 1 by 100 this is the expanded form of 20.03. Next, second one. 2.03. Now, uh, we are having a 2.03 and we need to expand this uh, 2.03. So, we have 2.03, which is equal. So, now 2 is at one's place so 2 into 1 plus 0 is at a uh, tenth place so 0 into 1 by 10 plus now 3 is at 100th position so 3 into 1 by 100 So this expand form of 2.03. Third one, 200.03. point zero three. Which is equals to now this is a this particular zero is at one's place this zero is at tens place and these two is at hundred place so two into hundred plus zero into ten plus zero into one plus this particular zero is at tenths place so zero into one by ten plus three into three is at hundred uh, place so three into one by hundred so this expand form of uh, two hundred point zero three Fourth one, two point zero three four. Two point zero three four, which is equals to now two is at one's place, zero is at uh, tenths place, and this is at hundredth place, and four is at thousandth place. So we can write it as 
2 into 1 plus 0 into 1 by 10 plus 3 into 1 by 100 plus 4 into 1 by 1000. So this is the expand form of 2.034. In fifth question, so we need to uh, write the expanded form for uh, decimal numbers. So simply what we need to do is, so we need to identify the position of that particular number and with that particular number, we need to multiply the position value. For example, in first problem, like a 2 is at 10th place. So we are multiplying with 10 and 0 is at 1's place. So we are multiplying with 1. Similarly, after point, we are having 0. 0 is at 10th place. So we are multiplying with 1 by 10 and 3 is at 100th position. So we need to multiply with 1 by 100. Next, moving to the sixth question, write the place value of 2 in the following decimal number. In that first one is 2.56. In the question they are asking like write the place value of 2 in the following decimal numbers. Now 2 place value is so 2 is at 1's place. So the place value of 2 in 2.56 is 1's. the place value of 2 in 2.56 is 1's. Next, second one. Second one is 21.37. In this problem, we need to identify the place value of 2. Place value of 2 is tens. So why? Because uh, like after point we are having 1. So 1 is at 1's place and 2 is at 10's place. So the place value of 2 in 21.37 is tens. Next, third one. 10.25. So, in this problem, we need to write the place value of 2 in 10.25. So, the place value of uh, 2 in 10.25 is 2 is after point value. So, it will be the 10th place value. the place value of 2 in 10.25 is tens. Next, 9.42. The given decimal number is 9.42. So we need to find the place value of 2 in 9.42. So the place value of 2 is, so 4 is at 10th place and 2 is at 100th place. So the place value of 2 in 9.42 is 100th position. Sixty three point three five two. The given decimal number is sixty three point three five two. So two is at this place. Now after point, this is the tenth place, this is the hundredth place, and this is the thousandth place. So two place value is thousandth. The 
the place value of 2 in 63.352 is is thousand eight place the place value of 2 in 63.352 is thousand eight the remaining topics will be covered in the next video thank you for watching please do like share comment and subscribe to geobyte geobyte